Hello, my name is the Retro Gaming Goose, and welcome back to a new episode in the series. And this is a Star Wars Rebel Strike Rogue Squadron Three. And this is the final bit of the Rogue Squadron series that I've been playing at the moment. Um, and yeah, we're just gonna get straight into this. This game is pretty good. I haven't played it as much as the other two. Um, but I remember it being pretty fun when I did play it. So, yeah, we're going to start again. As always, the name of our pilot, Goo. Yes, I'm sure. Okay. Um, like I've done in previous videos, I've turned the actual music down for Star Wars because you get copyright all the time. Do I have to do the training? Learn okay. flight controls and have come. to do the training. Okay, fine. But yeah, you'd think after it, like you should be able to be like, no, I've just played three other games, three or two other Rogue Squadron games. I don't need the training, but you know, we'll go through the training. Okay. You can reach your next mission objective by following the orange wedge on the radar screen. Follow it now. Ah, oh, I forget that's the gimmick in this one. Press the Z button while running to roll. Try it now. Good job. Press the Z button while running to roll. Press the Z button while running to roll. Pressing start shows your current mission objectives. Try it now. Good job. Press the X button to jump. Try it now. Good job. You can duck by pressing the R button. Try it now. Good job. Just trying to know what buttons are what, really. The C stick icon appears when you can perform a special action. Push the C stick in any direction to open the door. Try it now. Good job. Walk into one of the blue rebel symbols to select a craft. Let's go with the yeah. I forgot that this one's the one that they get they let you get out of the ship. So we'll see if this is actually any fun. You can reach your next mission objective by following the orange wedge on the radar screen. Follow it now. Good job. Press the L button to break. Try it now. Good job. You can hard break by pressing the button until you feel the click. Press the X button to enter cockpit mode. Try it now. Good job. When in cockpit mode, you can use the C-stick to look around. You can roll your craft by holding down the Z button. Try it now. Good job. This is training. I can't believe this is... you have to do this. Some ships come equipped with proton bombs. Press the B button to activate the bombing reticle. Press it again to drop a bomb. Try it now. Well, what am I... Well, what am I aiming for? Good job. Press the primary fire button to realign the camera behind the craft. Oh my god, this, this thing is rapid. Some ships are equipped with ion cannons. Press the B button until the crosshair changes color. Release the button to fire the ion blaster. Try it now. Good job. You can get a speed boost by pressing the R button until you feel the click. Try it now. Good job. After you boost, you have to wait for the thrusters to charge back up. Press the A button to fire the primary weapon of the craft. Try it now. Good job. Sometimes a command cross will appear in the upper left portion of your screen. This is the communications cross. Each direction on the cross corresponds with a direction on your control pad. Try it now. Good job. Okay, come on, last one now. There can't be much more. Some ships come equipped with lock-on missiles. Hold down the B button, lock onto a target, and release. Try it now. Good 
a job. Poor Bamfer. Press the Y button to bring up the targeting computer. Try it now. Good job. Use the target computer Ooh. to identify other units. Friendly units are displayed green. Hostile units are red, and critical units are yellow. Come on, Luke. Let's head to Beggar's Canyon. You got it, Wendy. Oh, great. Here comes Fixer. I bet he's still sore about you beating him in that race. I'll show him who the best pilot around here is. Well, well, well. If it isn't Skywalker. I see you managed to get that hunk of junk back into the air. Now let's see what you can do with it. Race against Fixer through Beggar's Canyon. You're no star pilot, Skywalker. Let's see what you got, Fixer. Can I not just shoot him down? Wouldn't that be so much easier? I suppose I'm Luke Skywalker, so I'm a good guy. Oh, that's on me. And again. Random, didn't I? Better than I thought, Skywalker. Mate, this ship does has absolute rapid fire. You got him. And apparently, you can just ram people. That's all. Next time you're mine. What a sore loser. You have finished the flight training. You may explore the rest of the map or return to the homestead. Right. I want to do the actual missions, please. I want to fight the Empire. Ah, oh, do I have to do this now? A speed boost by pressing the R button until you feel the click. Try it now. Good job. After you boost, you have to wait for the thrusters to charge back up. Press the L. Try it now. Do I have to put this? End training. I'm just going to do that. I cannot be bothered. I can figure this out. Is it good? Please. Let me select the mission. Finally, Revenge of the, the Empire. Have landed on Yavin. This is a great level. I love this. I love the concept of this level.
Cool, let's go. Rogue Squadron 3, Rebel Strike. Can I skip this? Does anyone care about the opening text? I don't particularly care. I just want to shoot things. You know what, I'll let it play out. I just got to try and talk over the uh, the Star Wars music because I don't really want to get a copyright strike, but yeah. A massive Imperial fleet has invaded the Rebel base on Yavin 4 in an attempt to capture the Rebel leaders. Enacting swift retribution for the Alliance's earlier victory, I'm guessing like the destruction of the Death Star. Uh, in the face of this assault, a small squad of freedom fighters led by Luke Skywalker, or the heroic Luke Skywalker, and Wedge Antilles attempt to escape the planet for a new secret base. <gasps> Will they do it? Well, this is the final Star Wars Rogue Squadron game that they released, so we don't know. It's all up in the air. Nostalgic seeing this type of graphic. I don't know why. See how the X-wing feels in this one if it's got like ridiculous firepower like it did in the last game. Come on, let me play. Let me play. Oh my god! Everything seems so much more rapid fire in this one. I don't ever really remember the um, the X-wing firing this fast. This is ridiculous. It's really fun though. I'm not gonna lie. This is so fun. Is that all of them? I'm guessing so. Easy. You should also watch over that rebel transport on the island. I oh, would we'll just do everything, shall we? 
No wonder Rogue Squad and Unity seems to get anything done in the Rebels. I just feel like they've upgraded the X-Wing to have like mini guns for blasters. It's ridiculous how quick it fires now. I can't wait to see what the A-Wing's like. I feel like the it seems a lot more responsive in this game. I feel like it is a little bit easier as well, maybe. Maybe that's just me. We've got to get to the general before it's too late. Wedge, follow me in. Sarkley, join the others and escort the transports past that blockade. You won't stand a chance. I'm going with you. We'll be fine. The fleet needs your help now, Sarkley. As you wish, Commander Skywalker. I feel like he's going to end up betraying everyone alone. to the Empire. Right alongside you, Luke. I just have that feeling that he is going to betray everyone. It looks like the generals retreated deeper into the base. We better act fast. What is this? You have a lightsaber, Luke. Use your lightsaber. This is so strange. I don't like it. I don't like the run animation. Oh. Follow me. Right with you, Luke. I do. <laughs> this is so strange. I don't like the camera angle that much. This feels like it should be on like an arcade cabinet. Sprint button. I 
it can jump so high. Imagine if you saw someone jump like that in real life. You'd be like, what is this for? Why are they not in the Olympics? Just keep moving there, isn't really that. I don't think I've really been hit much. He says, I'm getting hit. You just gotta use the mini map to find the people you're trying to kill. Imperial reinforcements will be here in moments. This looks like our last stand. We can't possibly fight our way out of here. Bet we can. Miracles, Luke? Absurdly. If it hadn't been for Skywalker, Sarkley wouldn't find any survivors. Commander Skywalker, we owe you our lives. Nice. Cool. We've done this it. This is an unfortunate turn of events. Ooh, that's a weird they animation. They've only delayed their destruction. Our destiny will be fulfilled. I wonder at what point in this Sith and in like the Empire when you're like, maybe, maybe we're losing. Like, at what point, like, when the first Death Star blows up, I get it, you still got the the rest of the Empire. But you still would be like, no, but maybe maybe these guys are quite good. Like, rather than being like, oh, their destruction is inevitable. Rendezvous with is the it? Imperial Defector Tycho on Dantooine and deliver him safely to the Rebels. Defense of Dantooine on a speeder bike? This is going to be weird. Defense of Dantuin on a speeder ball. My readings show a heavy okay. concentration of Imperial forces in the area. This is bad. There shouldn't be any Imperial forces here. This is Tycho. Abort the mission. I've been discovered. They've got me surrounded. He's been captured. We've got to get him out of there. Oh, he's betraying us. He is so betraying us. Oh my god. Oh, this is rapid. Oh my god. Okay. Right, we'll try that again. Does this just have one speed? This is ridiculous. I was told there would be a break. ridiculous I'm sorry that was so hard the super sensitive and super quick which is like the worst combination of things keep 
moving, scum. Fool. Did you really believe that your spying would go undetected? The secrets you've uncovered will die with you. Tygo's been taken aboard one of the Imperial APCs. Can't let them get away. Luke, you've got to stop that Imperial APC. If it gets onto those transports, we'll lose Tycho. Ah, just like the Luke Skywalker I know, mowing down hundreds of people. Did I do it? Yeah, I did. You got here just in time. We've got to get out of here. Oh god, another bike sequence. This is gonna be ridiculous. Follow me, Skywalker! Get my exact rate of boost. Oh my god. What? Okay. What is going on? Oh my god, this game is wild. They are just throwing images at me, I don't know what's going on, there's just like bombers, flashing lights, rain, going like a million miles an hour, the textures are popping in and out, I don't know what that guy's doing on his speed bike, he's flying about. Right, at least I'm in the river again, I know where I am. Oh my god, can you get hit by lightning? The game needs to stop doing that. Just go into a black screen before like, there's like a loading transition, I guess. Who are those guys? I've never seen stormtroopers like those. Those were storm commandos. They're elite soldiers responsible for carrying out special operations against the Rebellion. The primary mission of the Storm Commandos is to acquire new technology for the Empire. They've been capturing teams of scientists from all over the galaxy. I have information about an existing plan to capture scientists from the planet Raltea. The researchers have developed a powerful new planetary shield. Alright, I'm going to do one more mission and gonna, that's going to be the end of part one. Them already. We've got to get word to the Alliance to send a rescue team to Raltea. I think I know a pilot who can get there in time to help those researchers.
Master, one of our officers has defected to the Rebellion. It is believed he has supplied them with valuable information. It is of no consequence. Our forces have already blockaded the planet Ralti. Wild. Cool, bronze. Right, whatever. Probably because I died a few times and I was just randomly firing. This mission is available to unlock. Disguised as Imperial Stormtrooper. Okay. Why did it skip me up there? Why did, why did I do that mission first before I did? Defense of Dantooine. Okay, Defenders of. I see how this works. Locate and defend scientists trapped on the besieged planet of Raltir. And I get to use a snow speed. This is the weirdest mission select ever. Based on information provided by Tycho, we believe a group of scientists are hiding on the planet Raltir. The Empire has sent Star Destroyers to bombard the planet until the scientists turn themselves in. You must reach the scientists before the Imperials, and then get them off the planet. Again, this is like before the Battle of Hoth, so you probably shouldn't really know to do this. All right, let's go. We're getting a distress call from the scientists. Lieutenant Commander Skywalker, we set up a shield around the city. We can't escape with those Imperials here. We've created a bomb for you to use. Fly down and fire off your tow cable. Copy that. Get ready with that tow cable. Oh my... I genuinely thought I could fly through the shield. Okay, that's on me. The shield is weakening! Is that what I was supposed to do? Yes, I'm saying. To see this exact animation. Lazy game. Lazy.
Come on. Got it. Even though the rope just fell apart. Okay, however. The shield is weakening. We need fire support now. Ugh, I hate these angles sometimes. Let's go take out that last bridge. This just seems to be a lot to do in this level compared to the other ones. Is that what I'm supposed to be doing? Let's just check. Destroy the Imperial threatening the shield generators. That's it. I just have to destroy them all. All my health, all my lives. I bet it is. I bet that's mission over. Will we try that again? And I'll actually try and defend the bridge. All right, retry, and I'll actually try and do it this time. What? I start all the way back here. I feel like I've missed a mission. I like. I'm gonna just quickly go through them all. Read it. Yeah, I've missed this one. All right, what I'm gonna do. Defense of Dantooine, Revenge of the Empire. The Imperials. I am going to do this mission, and then I'll come back to that next one and the next one. Okay, that makes sense to me. And then I'll call it there. I felt like there was a bit of a difficulty jump. I don't know why it's like, ooh, B-wing. All right, cool. I hate the B-Wing. It was rubbish in the last game. Just as bad as it in this one. Actually, I don't know. It probably will be. I don't know what special it's gonna what anything special it's gonna do. There's a transport! We need to disable it before it enters hyperspace. I need to use my ion guns. I don't want to destroy the transport. Disable the transport. Now let's provide cover for the evacuation team. This is going to be tricky. We need to disable all the transports and cover their evacuations. We've got to keep those ties away from the evacuation team. What are your orders, Wedge? Take out those ties for me. Copy that, road leader. Going after the ties. Rogue leader, 
this is Rescue One. We're in position over the first Imperial transport. Evacuating prisoners now. Yeah, I know you are, okay, mate? I know. But this ship is, like, doing its own thing right now. Rescue one here. Evacuation complete. We're preparing to make our escape run. Form up! Pouring on your wing. Right, where's the next place? Where are we going next? Rogue leader, this is Rescue One. We're all clear. Ready to make the jump to hyperspace. This map is awful. Where is it taking me? Sometimes I really hate levels that are just in space because you cannot tell where you are. There goes another transport. I need to use my ion guns. see it I just feel like this ship's very slow Rogue leader, this is rescue three. We're in position. Evacuating prisoners now. 
cool. Right, let me fly over there before you start screaming that you're being attacked. Is that it? Is that the level? What is this? Looks like some sort of gunship. Rebel scum. Where do you think you're going? Does look like a Stand pretty down cool. and prepare to be boarded. We have to stop them before they get to the scientists. That does look like a pretty cool uh Made in here. Don't let that ship escape. Follow me if you dare. We've lost a ship! This is bad. We better act fast. Whoever that was, it looks like he's escaped with our scientists. Judging by the vessel's last known trajectory, I'd say he was heading for Geonosis. Looks like I'm going to Geonosis. Whoever that was, he won't get away with this. How strange. The situation is well in hand. The rebels still do not grasp the scope of our plans. Yes, my master. He is resourceful. So is there like three different campaigns going on at once in this? Okay, I think that's pretty much going to be Rescue from Geonosis. Oh, I get yeah. Can we even get a medal for that one? Somewhere. All right. Well, what I'm going to do is I'm going to leave it there, and that's Lovely going to be part two. Side. Is going to be that next bit. So thank you so much for watching. If you have Disguise enjoyed this, please remember to like and subscribe, and I will see you in the next video. Disguise